Now that you've been using Schoology for a while, let's look again at the notification settings. You want to personalize your Schoology account so you get the information you want and need, but are not inundated with information you do not need. Let's go ahead and start by clicking on this little down arrow to the right of your name, and then select notifications. The default method for notification is email, so you'll have a column with choices here. If you've downloaded the app to your mobile device, you'll also uh, have a, a column here where you can choose to be notified that way on your phone or iPad. So the academic area here at the top, this has to do with um, how you want to be notified about your courses. If you are teaching a course, you probably want all of these items to be either on or custom. So when you turn it on, it means you'll receive a notification for every course that you teach or to which you belong. So in my case, I uh, don't want to receive notifications for every single course that I'm, that I'm enrolled in, only the ones that I teach. So I've chosen custom. When you choose custom, when you click, you click on edit, and you get a list of all the courses that you are a member of. And you can choose just those courses that you want to receive information about. And you can go through here and see all the different options, uh, the different ways that you'll get notified for certain things like tests or assignments or course updates. And you can choose um, to have the same notifications for your mobile or they can be different. In the next section is for groups. So same idea, uh, various things that you can be notified about. You can choose on, off, or custom. In this case, I definitely want you to choose um, custom and then select CAMS teachers, CAMS parents, and CAMS student announcements. Definitely want you to be uh, receive announcements on those groups so that you can be in the loop about updates sent to parents and students. In the next section, under school, go ahead and turn school update on, although we're not really using that feature a lot right now. In the last section under personal, make sure to turn on receive a private message because you will have uh, many students contacting you that way. And finally, make sure to scroll down and click save changes. Remember, you can always come back to modify this page if you find you're not receiving uh, the amount of notifications that's, that's optimal for you.